Hi everyone, it's um, June 13th, 2024, and I have words of the Lord from today, and I'm just going to say a quick prayer and get started. Lord Jesus, thank you, Father, for this day, for your guidance and direction, Lord. I pray for my brothers and my sisters. I pray for the body of Christ, Father God, that we would come together in unity, one accord, one heartbeat, your way, your will, in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for their homes, their jobs, their coming and their going, Lord. I pray for their families and their children. Guide us, direct us, let this message go to every ear and heart that needs to hear it. I give you all glory, honor, and praise, Father God, that we would just, Lord, have your way, Father. Have your way that we would all walk in your truth, your way, your will. That we would rebuke anything that is not of you in the mighty name of Jesus. I thank you, Father God. Amen. Okay. Um, June 13th, 2024. Double-mindedness in the body. Pray for one accord. A house divided cannot stand. Tell them to pray for truth. Bring me your hearts and walk in one accord. Too many listening to the lies of the enemy and not my truth. Punishment to those who are divided, who are dividing my house in their own judgment. I call for repentance. Pride is not of me, but humility lies of the enemy are going out and nobody is discerning but taking those lies as truths trusting in the father of lies many currently falling away for that reason this is the time of a great falling away they chose not to come to my feet for truth a reprobate mind i will give them they will believe and follow the lies did I not say come to me for truth? I am the way and the truth. Testing children, will you pass or fail? Everything these days are crucial. Who is truly bringing me your heart? Truly bringing me your heart for truth. I know all, not man. My own know my voice and they follow me, not man. Discern through me, not man. Call on me, not man. Bring me your hearts, children. I am calling you now. Chaos is upon this land. And you will be lost, unable to hear my voice for direction. Time is of the essence. I send my prophets and messengers with my messages, my truth, and some have gone astray. The enemy is in the camp and many have been deceived again by getting their ears tickled. Check your hearts, my children. I said you will know them by their fruit. Once again, the message's less popular is the truth, my truth. Bring me your heart for correction. The enemy has been let into the camp. The devil is a liar and the father of lies. Jesus the son of the, Jesus the son came in the flesh to set the captives free. Shed his blood that you, my children, would truly live for him knowing truly how to live for him coming to him properly in your bibles praying for truth and guidance fasting denying your flesh and worshiping the lord god almighty those are the proper ways to seek find your firm foundation many are not on solid ground and i come to shake this foundation be not deceived children the lord god almighty will not be mocked i am the only way the only truth to everlasting life. And apart from me, you can do nothing. But with me, I will make a way where there is no way. I am your safe covering. Bring me your hearts wholeheartedly. I will show you truth and give you my peace of mind. I will give you peace of mind, sorry. I am the way. Come now, my children. Put down the lies and follow me. Yeshua, the true Messiah, Jesus the Christ, I am that I am. Great is my faithfulness. And that's the message for today. Um, God bless you guys. Take everything. Always, always take everything. Pray. And if that's not enough, that you you feel like you're not getting an answer, fast and pray. Fast and pray. It's very, very crucial. We can't believe everything we hear. Even Don't even believe everything I say, but take everything to the Lord. You have to fast and pray. And do not lean on your own understanding. Because what might sound good to you, 
in your in your walk might not be what's the the truth take everything to the lord um and properly seek him that means in your bibles daily and and it's not just a little verse here and there you have to live in your bible read chapters get to know the people of the bible pray for truth and guidance open up your bible and pray lord give me discernment understanding revelation teach me if it's hard he will show you he will it was very hard for me and it's very hard for everybody when they first start but the lord will guide you guide you like i always say holy spirit is your teacher fast and pray and worship the lord god and all of those things is what he's saying is the proper way to seek him so god bless you guys take everything always to the lord pray truly truly pray for truth if anything pray for truth pray for guidance and direction and truth lord jesus block deception from my ears let me not hear deception let me not hear the lies of the enemy the devil is a liar and jesus is lord ask for guidance in prayer and if you seek with all of your heart you will find you feel, will find him the lord wants to show you truth he wants you to hear him at this time there's going to be a time where youtube isn't going to be available and you're not going to know what to do because you you can't hear the lord and he speaks to us differently but if you put down this world all of this is is um it's like static it's there's a barrier if if you if you're watching all of this and listening to all of this other stuff and not paying spending your time he all of him needs to come before everything else but if you shut everything down and you're doing a fast focus on just him he's gonna guide you and he's gonna show you what you need to see you'll know it in your heart you'll hear it he'll start there was one of our sisters that um oh gosh I can't remember her name on YouTube, but it, it's oil. She started hearing from the Lord and she was so excited. She was so, I think this was yesterday morning. Um, oh, I can't remember her name, but um, I know that we all can hear from the Lord. It Nobody, I am no, nobody more special than you. Um, he's giving me messages to share. But he needs to be able to, to direct you when the chaos is here. You need to be able to hear him. You need to be able to, to hear, feel Holy Spirit. You need to be able to feel his guidance. Know his guidance. Know his word and how he speaks to you. Because he speaks to all of us differently. And it's so crucial at this time to put everything down and seek his heart above anything and everything. So God bless you guys. Um, I pray that you are getting in and pressing in and seeking him because we don't know what's coming, how it's going to come in your area or my our area, but he is our covering. He is he takes care of his own. Seek him, pray for your families, pray for your neighbors and pray for a covering, a safe covering, supernatural protection, guidance and direction, supernatural peace of mind and heart and pray to hear him pray to have ears to hear and eyes to see and a heart to take in his truth pray for truth above anything do not be deceived at this time it is a very very late hour to be walking in deception you, you if you're in deception you're not even going to know but you're if you're pressing in he's going to show you he, he will show you truth he will show you and guide you to the way his way he, he is the way and the truth um, God bless you guys. Good night.